Now these are the three calculators allowed for the FE exam. Uh, it doesn't matter which one you choose, before you pick one, just understand that you need to start using it today to learn how to use it efficiently for the FE exam. The first one is the Casio, the second one is the Texas Instruments, and the third one is the Hewlett Packard. Now I'm going to be giving you a quick rundown of each of these calculators. If you want more information, click the link below. It's going to take you to the blog post that talks about them in depth. Today I'm just going to give you the basics. So with the Casio, there's a couple of different models to choose from. Um, most of them are discontinued, so you can't really find them unless someone hands it down to you, which is great, you get it for free, uh, and you get to use it for this exam. But the, the latest one is the FX115ES+. Plus. Big name, but it's just a simple calculator that you can use for this exam. It's actually the cheapest on the bunch, it'll cost you around 15 to 20 dollars. The main point of this video is to show you that whichever calculator you do use, you need to start using it today so that you know how to use it for the FE exam. The second calculator on the list is the Texas Instruments. Now it comes in a couple of different models. The two I have listed here are the TI-30X, which costs you around 10 to 15 dollars. And the second one is the TI-36X Pro. Uh, that will cost you around 18 to 25 dollars. The main difference between this is uh, capabilities. So you'll be able to do more with the Pro model. But if you don't use it efficiently, you might as well go with the, the regular model and save some money. The third one is the Ferrari out of the bunch. If there's money burning a hole in your pocket, you're going to get this one, okay? Just don't get the older model. If it gets passed down to you, it's going to be useless. Um, it's the discontinued HP 33S. The new model, the 35S, uh, is the most expensive out of the bunch. It costs you around $45 to $55. So this was just a quick video showing you exactly what options you have for calculators for the FE exam. Now as I mentioned earlier, you need to start using them today. So click the link below and it will take you straight to our blog post which has a couple of different links uh, showing you tutorials on each of the calculators to see how they work. Uh, and if you have any questions, you know, comment them down below. Good luck on your exam.